Hey guys, what's up? <laughs> Woo! Spirit is in the building. Okay. Please don't forget to hit that like button, guys, to support my channel. Also, I have to go and fix the uh, join on it on my channel. So you actually have to go and hit membership on my channel feed to get to my join. Um, but I'm going to fix that tonight if I have a, have a chance to. I'll uh, sue. What do I got to? Uh, yeah. So if you haven't subscribed yet and you're vibing, please hit that subscribe button. If you go down to the bottom, my description box, my information. If you want to get a personal reading, any questions, also donations are always welcome. PayPal, Cash App. Also, I think that Venom is on PayPal now. If you, um, I think I have Super Thinks and stickers too. Yeah. Okay, guys, let's get started. Let's get started. I hear that somebody wants to be you. Wants to be you. Wants to be you. I still haven't changed my thing out, so please don't mind this. It's wax. Okay, so somebody looks in the mirror and tries to talk like you. I'm also hearing somebody that you know may have like a English accent or an Australian accent. They may be um, Australian or from England or they just have a fake accent. I've been hearing this voice a lot lately. And the third thing is that there's some kind of white vehicle that's been driving by your house. All right, Divine Father, Mother, Ancestor, Spirit Guides, and the Most High, please surround us, enfold us, and protect us with your light. Anyone setting any spell work, evil eye, or negative intentions towards us, please send it back with full forgiveness. Thank you, thank you, thank you, amen. Archangel Michael, will you please protect us this time? All right, so let's get down to the nitty gritty, see what's going on. Thank you guys for your beautiful comments. I love you guys so much. And remember, if you're new to the channel, all I ask is that you respect my um, my family, the other subscribers, the other viewers, and that you don't disrespect me in the comments. If I find that you're being very disrespectful, I will delete you. I'm not about the clout. I'm not about the subscribers, even though, yes, I love building my family and I love all you guys. I even love my haters, but I will not deal with disrespect. I have boundaries myself, and I try to teach all you guys to make sure that you have strong boundaries. Okay. Remember, we're all each other's teachers. This person could drive by your house and see how you're like, see if you're outside to see what you're wearing so they could try to dress like you. Something about that. You might have like a unique way you're dressed or you do things. This person um, is very jealous and envious. This person is a drama starter. Look at this right away. Drama starter and clout hungry. Come through, come through. Yep, this person wants to eat up all your goodness, all your all your light, all your energy. It doesn't matter what they do though, because you're still surviving. You're a survivor, right? Yep. There we go. There's a little cute mouse. And we got the drama starter.
They ain't shiznick. They ain't shiznick. In their head, overthinking, stressed, overanalyzing. So this person's definitely overanalyzing things. Grudge. They're holding a grudge. I'm hearing something about the number three. Three. Because there's three candles. There could be three people. Looking for dirt on you or vice versa. Dirt digging. A dirt a digging. So you could be looking for dirt on them or they could be looking for dirt on you. Thief. Robbed, lost, theft, physical or emotional. So this person is definitely a thief. They could have stole something of yours. Maybe your identity. Caught in a case. Sexual infection, sexual disease or a rash. So this person has some kind of sexual disease. Fake flexing. Acts rich, flosses, money, attacks, fancy, shows off. They may also be using fake money. <laughs> blocking. The blocking. They're blocking. They're trying to block you from having another relationship. And a lot of us, please don't say I don't want to have a relationship right now. Because this is for... I got I'm reading it how it is, but this is just in general. So if anybody likes you, they're trying to block that person. And remember, it's okay if somebody likes you. That just means that, hey, you're beautiful, you're handsome, and you just, you have a presence about you, right? Nothing to it. Karmic friends. Can't fully trust them. Tension. Secret. Competition. Keep your friends close and your enemies closer. So these are karmic friends. Could have been from your past. You may have already cut them off. Romantic love affair. They may be having some kind of sex fix or secret love. There may be some, something going on there. And maybe these people are the ones that got these this sex uh, disease they could have been using sex magic is what I'm hearing wow okay gotta write down the download guys gotta write down the download sex magic tutta fruta oh tutta Maybe someone's name is Rudy or Tootie. <laughs> They're being a little fruity. Okay, so they could be a Scorpio. Um, this is also like a rebirth. This could be, um, you could be a Scorpio or they can. This could mean also that you're going through a transformation. This could be, a, you know, an ending to a cycle and a new beginning. So, and I got a Virgo. Somebody could be in like um, hermit mode lately, soul searching. You could be, or they could be a hermit, or I mean a Virgo. Um, I see spirit all around you. You've had, you, you've had a lot, a lot of lessons that's how i'm gonna put it you'll be born in september you don't have to be i just see a long road this person's been through a lot you definitely like the water something about the water um clarifies stuff for you
you haven't meditated, then spirit is telling you to meditate. All right. Um, there could be some kind of spiritual union, soul contract come together. Now, this could also be like you talking to like um, a loved one again, like a kid or something like that. And remember, this might be for the 2% if it is love. If it is a relationship, it might be for the or 2 or 10 or whatever percent that do want love, okay? Sometimes love comes when we don't want it at all. So please, I don't want to hear nothing in the comments. This is for the people who are looking. You know, all you got to do is say, no, not now, I'm not ready. Right? Or this could be, like I said, somebody in your family, somebody that you love coming back in your life. You could be getting some kind of telepathic communication or dreams. You could be having some kind of dreams about this. Obsession. Must have. And this is in the reverse. So this person is not obsessed. Okay. This person is not part of this crowd that is having this, um, doing this, this sex ritual. This, these people are doing this sex ritual that I'm hearing because they're, they're thieving from you. Your, um, your name, your energy, your life. You could have a channel. This person was definitely not committed. This come in the reverse. So this also could be somebody that you're, it has been coming in your mind. So you could also take this as this person is an ex. That is, tell it, you know, that you thought was like a soul contract. Maybe at the time it felt like it. Okay, so take it as it resonates. And this wasn't a long-term relationship because this person... Like, not that anybody should be obsessed, but this person was, like, not really the way they should have been into the relationship, is what I'm hearing. Maybe this person just wasn't loyal. And now your name triggers them. Anything about you triggers them. Yeah, there was definitely a lot of emotions in this relationship, but something came to light. Maybe it was some kind of a uh, secret love affair or something that you found out about and you cut it off with this person because of this. You found something out and you could have ended. You could have ended because this is death. This could have could have said this could have even happened like a long time ago. This could have been somebody that you met in 2013 or something could happen in 2013 that ended but you definitely severed ties and you may be getting some kind of telepathic communication about this person that they're doing something this may be about this um Sex, um, sex magic is what I'm hearing. To let you know, yeah, supernatural. So there's supernatural involved. They're definitely being haunted. Your ancestors are on it. So somebody made um, some kind of voodoo doll of you is what I'm hearing. They used, they sacrificed some kind of animal. secret admirer has a crush so this came in the reverse so they're not a secret anymore maybe you know who this person is and this person is obs obsessed now so you don't consider them a crush
betrayal. They betrayed you. Something about their medical records. They may have thiefed your medical records. Somebody could have played off like they were you to switch out your medical records. I got thief. Alright guys, this is getting really deep. Somebody likes you. And they, they hide this from you. So this is a, definitely a separate person. Let me see something real quick, guys, here. All right, spirit, come through. There we go. There we go, there we go, there we go. Count your blessings. Yeah, because you got away by the hair of your chinny chin chin. You got something about January? Something could have happened in January or on the first of the month? Remember, past, present, or future. Potion. Remember a remember to practice self-love. Tempting offer has a high price. It could be 38 or 83. Could have been born in March or on the 3rd. Guidance, but where will lead you? All right, so if you've gotten some kind of guidance lately, make sure you meditate on that guidance. Make sure you make the right choices. Somebody could have gotten misguided. I don't feel this is you, though. I don't feel this is you. Mind, body, mind, body. We've got mind, body, and soul. Somebody, um, mind, the mind trickery to move them in a different direction is what I'm getting here. Um, they had an high, they had a, a, an offer that was very tempting, but it had a high risk. This could have, they could have sold their soul. They could have definitely, wow. They called on Kaylee, Kylie. Death comes from rebirth. There could have been a passing or could be a passing from this. This could also be um, also an ending to something and a new beginning. At 1313, these are two are uh, mirroring each other. I feel like um, the death angel is here to collect. I got 333, mind, body, and soul. Yep. So definitely I'm hearing that the angel is wanting to collect invasion of boundaries, violated um, dominance. This person, I'm hearing 28 or 82. This person definitely overstepped their boundaries with you. They're very invasive is what I'm hearing. You always you already have all the answers. You could be 34 or 43. So you have all the answers to this. So whatever this is going on. Stiffed, bored, and stuck. So this person is definitely stuck. And they look like they're about losing it. Look at this person's face. So you could be 18. Yeah, this person is not very happy. They're they're probably getting grays at a very young age. Cleanup time. Spirit is saying cleanup time. You'd be born on the 15th or something about 2015. Wow, this person is a this person is possessed. Somebody did so much black magic 
that they're possessed. I'm hearing Ouija board. That's something I will not play with is the Ouija board because, uh, yeah. I just feel like you're, when you play with the Ouija board, you're calling on, um, you don't know. You're not all, only calling on like your ancestors or past on loved ones, but you're always, you're calling on people who are in, they could have passed away in that home or wherever you're at. Um, you could sometimes pick up people from around the area. Somehow this person was messing with the wrong one and they got upset. They got possessed. So I have, it's time for a treat. 37 or 73. So, treat yourself. Voodoo in blue, back off. Yeah, so 22 or 222. Which is alignment, balance. Somebody is off balance. This person did something with this voodoo doll. Just, these people could be like sisters or this could be the same person because they look alike. Okay, maybe they're sisters or something. but Or this was them before and after. But if you see their faces, definitely... Um, possessed supernatural possession they're going to need an exorcism definitely strange love so there's definitely some strangeness going on here you are clearly clairvoyant so you could have the seven clairs You got strange love 27 or 72 and you clear you're clearly clairvoyant you could have either one of the seven clairs or the seven clairs is what i'm hearing your ancestors are coming back as these voodoo dolls this person could have blue eyes Yeah, this person definitely messed with the wrong one, the wrong one. This person is like wanting more, something about that. They want more of your energy. But Spirit says that you are protected and you're just getting stronger from all of this. To not worry. I feel that these people did something with the voodoo doll. And I, I they tried to get rid of this voodoo doll. And the voodoo doll came back. I don't know if you've ever seen shows like that. Where someone will throw something away and it will come back. That's what happened with these voodoo dolls. Or voodoo doll. I don't know why I said dolls. So it could have been like these three people that I've been picking up on. That they may have made one. I don't know who. Maybe they could have done something where they made a couple of them. But that was a mistake for them because it came back. There was a lot of betrayal here, though. And they messed up when they used animals. And now they're possessed with this supernatural... This person's definitely a liar. You're always ahead of the game is what I'm hearing though. And you don't have anything to worry about. 
divine timing. Everything comes out in divine timing. So you will know what you have to know within time is what I just heard. Meditation brings answers. Something about that. And then I got a year from now, some kind of peaceful resolution will happen. And remember, when we go through our transformations, we're getting new gifts and sometimes they're taking some away. So we have to get used to the way our body feels. And so we might feel a little weak. Um, that's why I'm getting recovery. Believe in the unknown and the impossible is what I heard. This is why I was getting that um, you have some some real, real people that are working for you. Um, I was getting the name um, Marie Lavu. Marie Lavu from New Orleans. There is actually, I'll see if I could find the guy and put it on my community board. He speaks about her and he tells the truth about her. And see, the thing is, is you believe in the Most High. And the Most High is taking anybody that is being sent at you because he's the one in charge. And he's making sure that they see who you are. You are one of his children. And they're protecting you. And that's why all this is turning back on these people. Because you are highly protected. You have angels all around you is what I just heard. Because you put a lot of belief in the Most High. Synchronicities. Pay attention to synchronicities and honor your beauty. Focus your mind. Thank your angels for helping you to focus on your priorities. The miracle of prayer, Archangel Sandolphin. Honor your beauty and synchronicities. You are protected. All right, guys. I love you. I love you. I love you. Remember, take what resonates and leave the rest. All right. I will see you guys tomorrow. Don't forget, you can go to my join until I get it fixed on my membership part. It says membership. It's right next to community on my board. And also, um, donations are always welcome. If not, can't donate, hit my like button or subscribe. And um, personal readings, reach out to me on my email. All right? Peace, love, and light, guys.